Hey everybody and welcome to Technology and Toys and today I'm here to help solve a problem for anyone that has recently switched from an older MacBook Pro to the new USB-C MacBook Pros or to help you along the journey if you're thinking of switching to the new MacBook Pros. Now as you should know by now the new MacBook Pros, MacBook Airs, MacBook, all the new MacBooks have one port, USB-C. It's used for audio, video, data, and most importantly power. Now on the old MacBooks we had this lovely thing called MagSafe. This little connector right here. And what that would do is it would connect to your MacBook magnetically, hence the name MagSafe. And the safe part comes from this. You can yank it out without destroying the ports or the MacBook or sending it flying across your room. Now with the new MacBooks you can look as hard as you want but you will not find that MagSafe port anywhere. Now, if you're someone like me who used a 2010 MacBook Pro for quite a long time, you've probably gotten used to and taken for granted MagSafe. And if you use the new MacBooks and you've come from MagSafe, it's not as easy to take the cord out. It's not impossible. It's not super difficult. I don't want it to sound like it's difficult. It's just not as seamless, not as easy. Now there are solutions. You can use little magnetic adapters like this one that have a little head that you plug into your USB-C port and just magnetically attach like that. Now this is great and all, but it does nothing to address the number of MagSafe or MagSafe 2 power bricks that you have laying around from your old MacBooks. Now there is a solution for that issue as well. Here I have a MagSafe adapter from Dreamvasion. As you can see on the box, it's got a MagSafe plug on this end, and it terminates into USB-C on this end, and you plug it into your MacBook like normal. And it supports all different varieties of MagSafe and MagSafe 2. And it comes in a black and a white. And let's uh, open it up. Give it to me. Tell me what you got. Show me what you got. I want to see what you got. And inside this little soft touch bag is the adapter itself. favorite part of doing this. Now this is pretty much as simple as it gets. You plug it in to your MacBook, MacBook Pro, MacBook Air, whatever USB-C MacBook you have, and it doesn't even have to be a MacBook. Whatever you have that charges with USB-C, this will work. So you have that plugged in, you take your MagSafe charger, And there you go, it starts charging it. It takes a little while for it to register, but it does charge, and it charges at whatever wattage your MagSafe charger is. Anywhere from 45 for the MacBook Airs, all the way up to 85 for the 15 and 17 inch MacBook Pros. Now this works with MagSafe, MagSafe 2 for the MacBook Pros with Retina displays. It works with the L connectors, and the T connectors. Now there's several companies that make solutions like this. This one in particular, as I said, is from Dreamvasion and on Amazon, it's about 22 bucks right now. It comes in a white and a black. Again, if you're upgrading from an older MacBook to a newer one, or you know someone who is currently in the process or is thinking of doing it or has completed it and still has old chargers like these lying around. The holidays are approaching. This might be a really, really good gift for those people. I'll have that link down below. You guys can go check that out and uh, share it with your friends. So that's it for this video, guys. I hope you enjoyed. I hope you learned something useful. If you did, be sure to leave a like and subscribe and turn on notifications so that way you get notified whenever I upload future videos. This has been Jake with Technology and Toys. And until those future videos, I'll see you all later. Goodbye.